cell that you're hitting there? Yes. This is the cell plate. That sits on top of the cap block. These blocks are all hollow blocks that the foundation is built out of. And then when we get to the top block is a cap or a solid block. That'll act as a moisture but also a termite shield. If we have termites into the house, they're usually going to be into these lower pieces of wood. Okay. And so if there's damage, we'll poke right through it. Okay. And, mm -hmm. uh, Keep poking away. Up, up on top here, you'll see a little bit of debris. That's probably going to be from rodents or from mice. And uh, that's not unusual to see in almost every basement, even sure. in a brand new house. Every house has a mouse. Yeah. Um, into this corner, you will see that they added a sprinkler pump. This is going to be a pump that's connected to a point system, which is just a perforated pipe that's driven into the ground, into the surface aquifer. And it's going to be hooked up through that second course of hose spigots onto the outside. Is that still functional? What's that? The pump system, is that still functional? Uh, no, the motor needs to be replaced. Oh. Yeah, it's just it's not a sprinkler system. Uh, no. <clears throat> the cost of repairing those pumps is usually more than the price of the water that you would run through the regular spigots. So okay. <clears throat> most people don't bother with those. Okay. It's basically a power assist for the spigot, is that what it was? Um, no. That but that's would be for the sprinkler. Its own source. Okay. So a point system will pull from the ground surface water. aquifer, which is just the water in the ground, okay. the same thing that the sump pump is pulling So it's down. not municipal water? Not municipal. Okay. The municipal water is going to come through the wall here with a plastic pipe feed, through the water meter, and then through the copper piping. Very good. House. Okay. Great.